Hey there, it's Tina Hart for Charleston Realtor here, and I bet you're wondering what is happening with the Charleston real estate market due to the coronavirus. So unlike the recession we had in 2006, 7, and 8, where homes had been overbuilt, this time we are underbuilt. So meaning that before coronavirus happened, we were low on inventory anyway, and now that a lot of sellers are hesitating to put their homes on the market, we are even lower on inventory. So it is still a seller's market. We still have buyers out there looking. You're not going to find a bargain here in Charleston because of the low inventory. Um, home prices have remained pretty steady. Let's see, I have some numbers here comparing it to um, March of last year because it's not the end of April yet, so I don't have April statistics, but um, the average house price in Charleston in March of 2019 was 379, and the end of March of 2020, it was 392. So we're still seeing appreciation in Charleston. March was probably too early to see the effects of the coronavirus on the housing market, but we all are, like I said, having a lot fewer sellers listing their homes right now, so we are getting into some more uh, multiple offer situations because of the lower inventory. Um, however, the good news for buyers is that when you do buy, your home is going to continue to appreciate and you get to take advantage of relatively low interest rates. So that is something that you can look forward to. Um, so anyway, let's see here. Last week, there were 519 new listings in Charleston, um, 355 homes went under contract or pending and 384 closed. So we've still got activity here in Charleston. Things are still happening. If you are considering purchasing a home, go for it. I mean, we've got a lot of stuff happening virtually. I was doing that anyway um, before this all happened. So virtual house hunting is not a new thing. It's just that it's new for a lot of other agents. Um, and if you're thinking of selling, you don't have to have people in your house. We can do it totally virtually, not a problem. You can do virtual open houses. There's lots of different things you can do. So if you have any more questions about the Charleston real estate market, please don't hesitate to reach out and let me know. Otherwise, I will talk to you soon. Bye. Hey there, it's Tina Hart for Charleston Realtor.